Welcome to this series where we are playing Reforged Eden for Imperium Galactic Survival. In the last part, we fought our way through the radar station and opened up the teleporter to the Xeno mainframe. And in this part, that is where we're going to be going. In fact, we might as well go there straight away. Because I'm, I'm effectively, what we're doing now is teleporting about one and a half kilometers away from the, um, the radar station. We're in this little room. Now, I'm going to be completely up front. I, I've got vague memories of this um, POI. I think I've done it once, but I can't remember anything about it. And so this is going to be quite interesting. Now, I'm just going to walk away from that for a moment. Now, at the end of the last video, we got a message warning us about an incinerator and the fact that we've got to find a switch. Um, so let's just have a look around here not seeing anyone here oh ah, okay what have we got here no okay i think it might be here because there's an arrow pointing up here. okay um Oh, wow. I'm detecting transmissions from the observation room, Commander. They do they do not appear to be happy transmissions. I was surprised that our ploy was successful. Okay. Anything else down here? Be What's in here? We've got a bathroom. <laughs> okay. Now, this is the incinerator room. Um, I don't think... I need to approach the comm... Who's in the incinerator? This system is down again, so I need to approach the comm terminal and read me my credentials before I can buzz you through. Okay. IDA, you didn't say I needed to pass a security check before you check me into the control room. I think we have trouble here. I have no solution to you, Commander. The only thing I can offer is a suggestion. Bluff. <laughs> Answer me before I turn off the heat. Uh, turn on the heat. Hey, pal. Sorry about the delay. I just dropped my ID. Tell me if I didn't fall. With... Tell me it didn't fall between the deck plates. If it did, um, sorry, it looks like it did. Are you sure that there's no way to get it back? Um, uh, now what's your name, soldier? Um, end of the grey. I think we're, we're trying. Okay, I'm letting you through. Just pull the lever behind you and show you know, to Carlite -like behind the desk. Okay. Um... Hey, what's going on here? I assume we got to kill him. Um, cannot access shutter door. <laughs> right, we've got a bit of ammunition. What we got in here? Light armor. Trouble is, is it can't take too much loot. Um, herbal tea, I suppose we'll take that. Yes, yeah, so this is where it's going to get a little bit tricky. Okay, so what do we do now? Can't access that. There's a terminal there. Appears to be a communication console with a line open somewhere else in the base. I need. Okay, receiving transmit. Attention, all personnel. We have an intruder in the security room. Enter the storage bay. Ah. Um, bandages. We're going to need to get to the inspect them from that direction. Um, 
Okay. And I exit from this side. As we press that down, nothing. Can't get him. Okay. Reload. <sighs> Ouch. Another spiky mushroom. You have to use the rocket launcher. Have to shoot this guy. Can't see him. Um. <laughs> okay. I think we got the. Wow. We have to use a lot of these bed kits. We like it or not. Um. Bandage is what we got to do. Enter the storage bay. Anything else here? Apologies, I'm not saying very much, guys. This is uh, a little bit intense. Who are you? Uh, hey, dude, I'm just chilling here. Okay. <laughs> right, there's. Sounds like there's mechs in here. I think I'm a bit tempted just to lob up. No, there's a turret down the end. <laughs> um, do, do, do. I'm just going to fix a few things here. <sighs> Mechanoid. Nice storage bay here. Yep. Ah, ha. Ah. Find the generator room. Oh, where's the generator room? Oh, generator rooms. Yep. When we get to there. Oh um, well. Can't see any nice loot here. The problem's gonna be hauling it out, especially if there's no access to small logistics container. That's no good. Some ultra rares here. Ooh yeah. A lock code. Um, we could destroy that, but um, so where are we going to go now? Oh, enter the generator room. This is 22. Something tells me that we've got to go back the other way. Do that too. The 
generator room is over there, but how do I get to it? It says the generator room's over there. Um, I'm completely confused. Been in here. Oh, oh well, what have we got here? Okay, we found something. Oh. Okay, over there. We have to destroy this. So this is an explosive one. Um, I think what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go back and um, we've got plasma charges. I'm just going to very quickly go back and offload some of this stuff I think that's best I can do I think and hopefully the it won't reset what we got here that's it Up straight back to here what we'll do is drop this in here um, back get rid of that put that and that in the fridge how much ammunition we've got plenty of ammunition you know just top up our health and of course we've come in at the top level so what we're gonna have to do is go all the way around here I'll see you once I get back to the what we call it And what we got, right, we've got to go up here now. Okay. nice loot down there but I don't think we can get to it anyways it's okay very warm in here all systems normal lockdown access um what have we got to do access uses logs okay that's nothing return to main menu uh I think it's access fire detection uh activate fire alarms living console fire leave can we Right, so there's some nice loot down there, but I can't see how we're going to get to it. Uh, I think we right enter the living quarters. <laughs> there's this is more of a a puzzle. Yeah, why? But so where's the living quarters? Um, and what have we got here? Nothing. Okay. Is the living quarters is over here. Um. Oh, walked into that one, didn't I? I was shielded against electronic intrusion, so I don't accept any enemy transmissions. Okay, now we've got a problem. Where am I going to spawn? Current location's no good. Um, we're going to have to respawn at the survival tent. Well, that. Right, just gonna have to make my way all the way back to try and get my backpack. So what I'm gonna have to do is walk all the way through. I'll see you once I get back to the Xeno mainframe. So here we are, we're back in the main thread. Uh I think we really need to pick up my backpack here. Right, we're gonna need I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. Um, um, there's no point healing up. Wow, that was painful. <laughs> um, right, I'm gonna eat a dino stew. Uh, get our health and that back. Oh, one thing I should have picked up. I should have picked up a health regeneration kit about that. Okay. Right, 
Where's it? Shotgun guy. <laughs> Some shotgun shells. Take the water in case. Um, here. Oh, I'll we'll take that. It's not. So it's. This is one of these POIs where it's quite difficult to actually loot anything because we've got to keep hiking back, drop things off. Uh, oops. Wow, what the. Oh, okay, quick, 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 quick. <sighs> Burning. Oof. Right, that's the last of my med kits like that. Oh, what have we got up here? Oh. Right. Um, I really want this stuff. So, apologies for this. We're going to do a little bit of running backwards and forwards. And what I'm going to do is just go and offload some of this stuff very quickly. Okay, here we are. We're back again. Oh, if you look down the bottom left, you see I've got indigestion. What happened is I accidentally at a... Uh, what can we call it? A... Uh, um, some medical stuff. Uh, I don't think I'm going to pick that up just at the moment. Uh, I think we're going to carry on doing whatever's down here. I'm only going to take a look here. Whoops. What have we got down here? So we got. Oh, oh great. <laughs> no, there's a turret around the corner there. There's a turret above us there. Okay. Um, this is going to get interesting. Right, got him. Oh. Um, right, I did bring the nano injectors with me. Uh, we're going to use one of those to get my health back up. Game is giving nearly giving me a heart attack. Game, we're gonna have to. <sighs> right, we we need to get rid of the turret that's above us. Looks so like there's a mini robot -y thing over there as well. I'm worried a bit, bit worried a little bit worried about my armor. Are we, oh no, we're okay for armor. Right, here we go again, guys. I'll see you once I get back to the Xeno mainframe. So here we are again. All oh, my backpacks scattered all over the place. I think somebody actually did post a comment about um, how uh, what this uh, yeah. A reforged Eden is like, and it is pretty brutal. Um, okay. I think we're, we're going to have a little bit of, whoops, gone the wrong way. Uh, have a little bit of a change in tactics here. I haven't, we're not really using the sniper rifle at the moment. Um, uh, kidding me get rid of this guy first right into that because I'm running out of meds um. uh. 
I'll just have you use another one of these. And we've got China Royal. Eat some of those steaks as well. Another one of those flaming roboty things. It's coming this way. Now we know that there's a uh, another turret. I think I got him. Um, we need another um, we need a Dino Royal suit. Okay, why can't I? Another. Okay. You guys are down here. Wow. <sighs> Top tip. We're going to do this POI. Bring a vast amounts of med kits with you. You're going to need them. Um, I can see you. Um. Let me just get into here. Right, it's going to kick off a re regeneration kit, I think. And we'll just load up another. Find out what's around here. How many of these guys are around here? Get you yet. Oof. There's a, a spawn around there. We need to get rid of that as quickly as possible. Right, we've got rid of the spawner. See what's around this corner now. Right, we've got another room. Okay. Um, we've got a switch there. Okay. Yep. Right, another way past the blast door, yeah. Air cord system. Switch there. Got a lock code on it. <laughs> right, there's a entrance up here. Oh, we got a terminal here. And we got another switch down there. What's this do? Warning, the turbines are operating at 100% capacity. Keep the mainframe system cool. It's a seat juice by the power system is shunted to the heat sinks in the dumped in the room, room onto the moon's regolith. In the event of an obstruction, the turbine pull down and shut lever located in each tower. Code nine, code seven one four nine. Do not shut down both turbines. I won't cause an explosion. I'm assuming that we've got to. Um, is it seven one four nine? What we got here? Well, that with us. Um.
We're going to blow the place up, are we? How do we get out of here? We not open blast doors. We just open the blast doors by blowing them up. Okay. MCP. <laughs> ah, you're in the wrong place there, matey. Okay, so this opens both sets of doors. Okay. Um, F to open the armored doors. Whew. I'm just going to go in. It's fully loaded. I can't pick anything else, so I need to trash some stuff. Looking through this window, we're nearly there. The only thing I can see is that, bingo, we found the terminal. It's middle of decrypting the Titan data. Okay, so I've got close enough. Let me just trash off. So I'm going to eat that. Um, okay, I'm a bit worried that we might get given something. Okay, there's another room. <laughs> So we're not done yet. Um, coffee cup. Too much junk now. Get rid of these. Oh, nice stuff in there. Nice stuff in there. Reload again. No, I shouldn't keep reloading, but uh, a little bit of paranoia. This it. Up to the terminal. Decryption program is currently running. Progress 24%, the remaining 2 hours, 17 minutes, 49 seconds. Full dot lockdown encryption there. Main menu control panel connections. Okay, so I'm going to do that. Configuration. Connection established. So receiving communication secure line. Accept the call. Hello, Commander. It seems you did right without me. Uh, it's not, I, I'm not completely useless, you know, even, but even I can't stop the decryption progress without the command console. I don't think this guy is going to tell me. Are you able to shut down the decryption or will I have to shoot the console? <laughs> I'm sorry, Commander, I cannot bypass the command c code either. I can, however, decrypt the data and download it. The rest can be purged from the system before the Xerix attempt to retake the facility. Uh, that leaves everything to chance that, that the data they've already decrypted contains the warp coordinates to the fleet locations. Without that data, we're dead in the water again. Safeguarding the fleet and the warp field generator technology is more important than finding them, Commander. The coordinates may still be in the decrypted data and Polaris is still a viable source of information. There is other ways to rejoin the fleet. Okay. Purge the data. We purge the data and hope that they have decrypted so far well, this is what we need. We can't let them. I agree with your assessment, Commander. The security of the fleet is paramount and I will do whatever is necessary to prevent casualties to UCH personnel. Have you decided to allow the description to continue? Had you decided to allow the decryption to continue, I would have taken matters into my own hands. Would you really have stopped me? Yes, Commander. Sacrificing the fleet's safety to return to them is an act of treason, no matter what happens. So ha how do we download what is already decrypted and purge the rest of the data core? Neither of us can access the data core without the command code. If the data partitions are removed, we cannot uh, corrupt the safety protocols, causing the identity of the Titan data to hostile entity and force the system purge. Once the partitions are out of the way, I cannot retrieve the decrypted files before the purge has started. What do we do? There is a switch located behind that door. I cannot pull the lever, but you cannot. We can. I can open the door for you, Commander. Thank you, idea. What door? Is there a door? Oh, there's a door here. So we've got to pull this. This is where the whole place blows up, isn't it? Yeah. System detected. Initiating system purge. I have initiated the system purge, Commander. But with the partitions removed, I've also started the data retrieval ahead of the purge. I'm sorry that you were forced to give up your chance to rejoin the fleet, Commander. Who knows? The answer may, we may need to find in the files we took from the system. 
what's in the data files anyway. Most of the information retrieval for the files is fragmented and incomplete without the rest of the data in the core. Perhaps the best way I'm sure is the mainframe was storing them backing up the files with another system that we don't have access to. I can can restruct many I can reconstruct many of the files that Xerox are not able to, as I'm familiar with the Titan system. Um, I was able to successfully reconstruct some of the video recordings of the fight between the UCH and the Xerox fleet, including a view from the external camera of the Cronus trajectory when initiating the warp drive. Can you calculate the trend? Yes, Commander. I should be able to calculate the Cronus track track. Yes, Commander, I should be able to calculate the Kronos trajectory from the recordings, but I was only able to reconstruct the data from one camera. It will reduce the accuracy of my calculations. It will take some time to finish the calculations of the angle, Commander. I ain't escaping back to the radar before this attempt at retake the facility. Yep. Right, can we, what can we snag from here that's of any great value? Certainly take those. We probably don't need the glass and the electronics. Um, I would like to take those as well. What we're looking for is valuable loot. Uh, take that. Rest. Uh, I mean, I could loot this uh, in slow time, but um, how do we get out of here? Got to go this way, isn't it? This is where we walk into more hostiles on the way back. Um, all right. So looks like we can't actually destroy the core in this building but then again that makes sense because if we destroyed the core we'd be trapped in a building with no external entrances deep underground so or so that would then be a problem where have we got to go now right only back to here um oh IDA, it seems to be a problem, Commander. I cannot find any more of the main mission story missions with the scope of the game. Since the developer is still working on it. What? Uh, okay, so let, let's give a big thank you to the Vermillion for Forge Master, builder of POIs, writers of stories, and balancer builds all round, guys. So that is effectively the end of the mission, oh, which is a little bit of a shame. I mean, it'd be really great if this was actually further extended because this is a fantastic mission in its own right. Anyway, guys, um, what we're going to do is go back to the radar station, and I think that's where I'm going to wind the video up. Right, so here we are. We're back in the radar station. I think we're just going to make our way back to the CV. So we're just going to go up into, well, we can go and pick up the tent. Um, pick up our survival tent. Jump back into the. SV, turn the thrusters back on, pull away again, oh, no, the hostiles, there comes the, <laughs> so here we are, we're back on the top of the capital vessel, let's just actually get inside because I don't have any EVA protection, and I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope you found it interesting, what I'm going to do is one more video on, in this series just to um, tidy up the series, tidy up everything. But and th then what we're going to do then is move on to Star Salvage. This is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you found it interesting. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.